Sacramento, California, man. Sacramento, California. Uzzy Marcus. So a lot of y'all might not know that um, Uzzy Marcus is in jail, right? So I'm guessing this, like his fourth or fifth gun, he was already out on bail for a gun case, two gun cases, I believe. And now he then went back for another gun case. So, like I said, this shit get real, you feel me? He got to keep that bitch on him at all times. He know he got to keep that bitch on him. Fuck the beef with me. I'm saying in general, niggas really hate that nigga. Niggas really want that nigga gone. So, you got to understand why the nigga always got it on him. You know that saying? I'd rather get caught with it than without it. See, Uzzy Marcus, I ain't going to lie. I don't like your little bitch ass. Cause you got the little funnies and shit. But at the end of the day, with this street shit, you not new to it. And you ain't no dummy when it come to this street shit. That's one thing I could say about you. You not no dummy like the rest of these other motherfuckers. I'm not even going to lie. A lot of these rappers, they real life dumb. They really don't live what they rap about. Like these niggas don't even drive around with poles. These niggas is scared to get pulled over by the police and all type of shit. I'm not even going to lie to you. That's one thing I could say. I know real street niggas from wannabe street niggas from rappers. You know what I'm saying? One thing about you, you live by that. I'd rather get caught with it than without it. And that's the honest to God truth. So, I'm hearing through the through the grapevine from my little sources and everything that he took five years. You know what I'm saying? So, man, that's what come with it. You know what I'm saying? That's what really come with it. You know what I'm saying? So, that shit is crazy. So, like I said, man, you got to keep that bitch on you. Any rappers out there, if you know you into some shit, if you know you beefing, if you know it really, it's really going to get slimy in the field, if you know your name hold weight to where niggas see you, they going to really break you off. You damn right got to keep that bitch on you. You know what I'm saying? So I was hearing that, you know what I'm saying, the marshals, U.S. marshals, they, they was following him. You know what I'm saying? And they got that nigga like that. So if I'm not mistaken, I believe the feds, I believe after so many guns, the feds pick your case up. So I'm... I'm not guessing. I just know that the feds pick. Because if the U.S. Marshals is in it, the feds damn near picked your shit up. Plus, you already went down for three, four guns prior to that. You just keep getting caught with guns. So, that's a fed case. So, nine times out of ten, the reason why he took five years is because of a fed case. Guaranteed. I can 100% bet you. But this is daily news in this motherfucker. Like I said, Uzzy Marcus, he, he, he a street nigga. He ain't one of them dumbass niggas who, who rap about it. The nigga really live what he rap about. You see what I'm saying? And he the type of motherfucker. He got to keep that bitch on him. He got to keep it on him. Like, he has to. You know what I'm saying? He he 100% has to. See, a lot of rappers, they dead. You know what I'm saying? Because they was rappers. You know what I'm saying? They really didn't carry that bitch on them 24-7 like how they were supposed to. See, if Briss would have... Briss, from the outside looking in, he was really beefing. He was really another Uzzy Marcus. He's beefing heavy to where his name hold weight. He got to keep that bitch on him. He was supposed to keep that bitch on him. You know what I'm saying? It's certain individuals who niggas really hate that got to keep it on them. You have to keep it on you. Like I said... That wasn't no diss to Briss or anything. That wasn't no trying to down talk the nigga. But you know like how I know that these niggas is on your head. And if you know that these niggas is on your head, you got to keep that bitch on you. Especially if you riding around in your city. You have to. 
You feel me? But like I said, man, uh, he took five years. You know what I'm saying? So y'all not going to be seeing Uzi Marcus for a minute for a guaranteed fact. You know what I'm saying? I'm guessing the feds picked it up. If he took five years, the feds picked it up for sure. So yeah, man. Live out of Sacramento, California, Daily News in this motherfucker. Let's get it.